Have you ever felt pressured into doing something you didn't want to do because someone played on your emotions? Welcome to the world of emotional blackmail, a subtle, often unnoticed form of manipulation. It's a world where guilt, fear, and obligation are weaponized to control and exploit. It's a world that can seem normal until you recognize the patterns. Today, we will delve into 10 real-life examples of emotional blackmail employed by narcissists. Prepare to uncover the manipulative tactics hidden in everyday interactions. First up, meet the guilt trip whisperer. This master manipulator knows just how to play on your empathy and your desire to please. They might say something like, if you truly loved me, you wouldn't say no to this. Such statements are designed to exploit your good nature and make you feel obligated to fulfill their wishes, even if they contradict your own needs or boundaries. This tactic can be subtle, but its effects are profound. Next, we introduce the future fabricator. This cunning manipulator likes to play on your fears, exaggerating negative consequences to sway your decisions. Picture this, they may say, if you leave me, you'll be alone and miserable forever, exploiting vulnerabilities they know you care deeply about. This bleak future, however, is often far from reality. It's a fabricated narrative designed to keep you under their control. Recognize this tactic to protect your future from their manipulation. Now, let's discuss the selective silence stalker. This emotional blackmailer uses silence as a weapon. After a perceived slight or rejection, they suddenly withdraw both affection and communication. This creates a chilling atmosphere of disapproval and guilt. It's a silent treatment designed to pressure you into compliance, to make you feel as though you've done something wrong and need to rectify it. Silence in this context becomes a powerful manipulative tool when used improperly. The fourth manipulator on our list is the you owe me tally keeper. Imagine someone constantly reminding you of past favors, the sacrifices they've made for you. They create a ledger in your mind, a sense of obligation and indebtedness subtly manipulating your behavior to meet their current demands. This, regardless of your personal limitations or desires, it's a clever yet toxic strategy. Remember, you don't owe anyone at the cost of your own well-being. Next, beware of the jealousy puppet master. This manipulator is a master of illusion, fabricating scenarios or subtly implying romantic interest in others to trigger your jealousy and insecurity. They thrive on your fear of losing them using it as a lever to control your behavior and emotions. It's a twisted game where your heartstrings are their puppet strings. Always remember, manipulating emotions like jealousy is a red flag. Don't let them play with your feelings like a puppeteer with their marionette. Now let's uncover the tactics of the public humiliation hangman. This manipulator employs a particularly cruel form of emotional blackmail. They threaten to expose your personal information or secrets publicly exploiting your fear of embarrassment and damage to your reputation. They use this fear as a lever to control your actions, making you dance to their tune to avoid public humiliation. This is a gross invasion of your privacy and personal boundaries. Remember, your personal secrets should never be used against you. Seventh on our list is the Martyr Manipulator. This master of manipulation plays the victim card to perfection exaggerating minor inconveniences into significant issues. They skillfully guilt trip you into feeling responsible for their suffering, creating an obligation on your part to rectify a situation you didn't cause. This is a powerful tool for control, exploiting your empathy and sense of responsibility. Don't fall for the guilt trip. You're not responsible for someone else's happiness. Next, recognize the emotional hostage taker. This manipulator uses the threat of self-harm as a tool of control, holding their own well-being hostage. They'll suggest that without your compliance, they may fall into emotional breakdowns or even threaten self-harm. This tactic is a chilling exploitation of your compassion and fear of responsibility. It's a way to control your choices, making you feel as though you are responsible for their emotional state. This is a serious form of manipulation that may require professional intervention. Ninth on our list is the broken promise bait and switch. The narcissist here is akin to a crafty fisherman using tempting baits of false promises, change, reconciliation, or improvements to reel you back into their control. But once they've got you hooked, they revert to their old manipulative ways. Their promises like mirages vanish into thin air. It's a classic bait and switch 
where the promised goods are swapped for something far less appealing. Remember, actions speak louder than words. Lastly, beware of the ultimatum architect. This master manipulator presents you with limited and unfair choices, cleverly designed to corner you into making decisions that favor them. By forcing you to choose between your own well-being and their desires, they create a pressurized environment that manipulates the outcome. It's a cunning game of control, where they construct the rules and you're left scrambling to keep up. But remember, you always have a choice. Your well-being should never be compromised for another's selfish demands. Now that we've explored these 10 examples of emotional blackmail, it's crucial to recognize these tactics. The guilt trip whisperer, the future fabricator, the selective silence stalker, the you owe me tally keeper, the jealousy puppet master, the public humiliation hangman, the martyr manipulator, the emotional hostage taker, the broken promise bait and switch, the ultimatum architect. All these are varied faces of emotional manipulation, each with its own unique way of exploiting empathy, fear, and guilt. Recognizing these tactics is the first step towards breaking free from the web of manipulation. Remember, emotional blackmail is a form of abuse. It's essential to prioritize your emotional well-being. Reach out to trusted individuals for support. Don't hesitate to seek professional help if you feel overwhelmed. Always prioritize your safety and well-being. And remember, you deserve healthy relationships built on respect and understanding.